right then. Today, right now, I'm gonna do something that I've put off for far too long. And that is, I'm gonna go to a Weybridge. I've been warned by a lot of, a lot of you guys that I should do it because I'm probably gonna be overweight. I think, so I'm gonna go and do it today. I found one that's not too close. I found one that's not too far from me. They charge five pound for a weigh-in. I'm a bit concerned. It's my work equipment is quite heavy that I carry right at the back of the van. So I may do a weigh now and then when I empty it, empty all my work equipment before I go on my trip, I'll weigh it then as well. So yeah. Let's see what happens. Another reason for me wanting to check the weight of the van is because of my kitchen. Now I want to have a live edge slab of wood as a worktop, but obviously they're quite heavy. So, depending on how this weighing goes, I thought I just saw Gadget John. There's a man here, looks just like Gadget John. So yeah, depending on how this weighing goes, will tell me if I can get, get a heavy worktop like a live edge piece of wood or if I have to get something else. So yeah, we'll see. So I'm a bit nervous about this weighing. The whole way through my build I've been thinking to myself, ah oh, it's a big van, it's meant to carry a lot of stuff, it's meant to carry a lot of weight. Builders supplies and bags of cement and you know, but I, you don't. I don't think I necessarily realised that I was building up that weight bit by bit. Each piece of wood I put in here, eat everything, just. So uh, we'll see. I just hope. I don't mind it being over, but I just hope it's not crazy over. Because then I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. So I've got all the wood in here. I've got my ch checker plate, my metal checker plate. Stuff. My new awning is heavy, my roof rack is heavy, got ladders on. You know, I've got a fair amount of weight. We'll see, we've got three minutes away. Somewhere here. Uh huh. It's recycling, metal recycling centre. They said they have a way bridge. So. <clears throat> yep, that looks like it. Just that big lorry's getting itself weighed. I'm guessing this place is, uh, yeah, you bring your scrap metal and they pay you for money, money for it, depending on how much you weigh. Good news, ladies and gentlemen. Good news, everybody. Overweight. But it is good news. Let me find somewhere to park up and I'll tell you about it. <laughs> the guy in there said to me, the guy in there said to me, you got cameras all set up in there? I'm like, uh, yeah. Oh, what's that for then? Um, I have a YouTube channel. He's like, all oh, right. I'm like, yeah, I convert vans to camper vans. Sugar, I'm like sticking out in the road here. Uh, yeah, I convert cam vans to camper vans. And he's like, oh, all right, that's interesting. Anyway, the weight. He did a printout for me. 
Now bear in mind, okay, I've got, I've got, my work equipment is very heavy. It's probably 200 kilos of weight in there. Plus, I've got a big water tank in there, which I, I haven't filled up. I've got a little bit of water in there that I'm carrying. All right, so I'm overweight. I'm overweight by 80 kilograms. 80 kilograms, so that's my weight. Just a one person's weight, that's, that's it. So, hang up. Out though, he took the way in when I was out of the van. So when I'm in the van, that's another 80 kilos. So anyway, it's does, I think that's how it works. Right, let me have a think about this. So the weight I can carry in this van is three and a half ton. Now that includes everything that is in the van. That includes, that is the maximum your van can weigh with people in it, you know, do you know what I mean? So I've got two seats here, so I, I'd have to include the weight of the passengers, the people sitting in the vehicle. So say I weigh 80 kilograms, say someone else sits, weighs 80 kilograms and they're in this, we've got to include that. 3,500 kilograms, three and a half ton. And I'm weighing 3,580 kilograms. So I've got to include my weight in that and include a passenger. And then my final figure will be, skip this bit where I figure out the math. I think my van weighs, if I had three, two people in here, would weigh about 3,000 740, which is obviously overweight. So I have got to lose a bit of weight to allow for my passengers. So in, in, in essence, this means from here on out, I need to get lighter, lighter bits and pieces. So my kitchen worktop is not gonna be the heavy live edge piece of wood that I really wanted. My wife will be happy because she didn't want that anyway. She thinks there's too much like natural wood in here. I wanted it anyway. So I've got to find a lighter work surface for the kitchen. I also, I haven't got a fridge yet. I don't think that, actually, I'll be replacing the cool box I've got in here with a fridge so that I won't be gaining much weight there. Uh, I'm just gonna have to go through the van. And, and, and I've been thinking about redoing my sofa anyway, so I may use lighter bat lighter wood, lighter battens like for that. Maybe I'll go on a diet as well, shift a few kilos. So I know that when I shift all my work equipment out to go traveling, I've got, I'm well underweight. This is certainly making me question the design for my next conversion. I've used the proper thick tongue and groove in this van, so I could have used the thinner stuff, but I just don't like the look of it. It's, it I feel like it's flimsy and I wanted it to be sturdy. <laughs> it really, this stuff really is. So I've still got to build a, like a little cupboard. So that's gonna add a little bit of weight. I reckon it's probably only gonna be another 100 kilos of weight that I'm gonna to add to this van. So yeah, I'm gonna to need to start putting my van on a diet. So 3,580 kilograms my van weighs. So that means I gotta start thinking about everything I put in here. But I do have a lot. I do have a lot of weight. I have probably about two hundred plus kilograms worth of work equipment. I've got the the Rhino roof rack. I've got the awning, which is really heavy. I've got so much wood in here. I have lost a, a seat, which probably helps. I've 
got a fridge to go in here, another cupboard, and like doors, cupboard doors and things, so. But I'm very pleased with that. I, I thought, I thought I'd be overweight. I don't know actually, there was part of me that thought, oh, they can take a lot of weight, couldn't they? But then there was, I've heard horror stories of people being a lot overweight, so that's, I'm very happy with that. So yeah, random little video for you. Get your van weighed. It's definitely going to change how I go forth now with this van. And it will probably change how I convert vehicles, convert my next van. So, get your van weighed. Alright, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.